Okay, so ngayon naman ay i-run natin yung star using the RCGD. So, you will share screen first. So, well, ito na yung mga na-open natin na um, data. So, if we're going to input our data, um, we can use yung data natin sa CRD. Pero as I've said nga, um, depende sa design ng experiment mo kung ano yung magiging output mo din or magiging or yung gagamitin mo sa iyong pag-analyze ng data set. So, whether it's an RCBD or CRD. So, ang kaibahan lang nito is that si replication dito, replication is always yan yung block. So, yun yung blocking kapag ka naka-RCBD. So, we will just click analyze and then analysis of variance, we will select RCBD or Randomized Complete Block Design. And then, ito yung makikita natin sa interface. So, itong si yield ay ilalagay ulit natin sa response variable. So, by the way, itong response variable natin ay pwede nating damihan yan dito. So, so for example, i-compare nyo din yung height, yung leaf length or leaf width, yung uh, roots, yung number of leaves. So, pwede kang magdagdag ng column dyan or mag-insert column or yung doon sa Excel file dito. Ayan, pwede nyo dagdagan ulit dito ng uh, leaf width, ayan, tapos leaf length, and then you, andito yung mga data set nila, and then you just, again, um, save as that CSV, or using yung interface uh, dito, then pwede mag-edit din dito, then save. So, by that, A method, you can minimize yung time ng pag-run kasi pwede mo siyang i-run uh, simultaneously lahat ng mga variables na gusto mong i-test whether they are significantly different from each other. So, dito naman sa factor is we put yung treatment dito sa treatment and then sa replication, ilalagay natin sa block. Ayan. Since yung replication natin ay um, in block. So, Uh, replication natin yung mga nakablock sa RCBD. Okay, so we press, click okay, and then wait, and then ito na yung ating um, data sample. Output, RCBD output.txt. Yan. So kung mapapansin natin dito, it's 0.002. So this treatment, Yan, should be less than 0.05 kasi 0.05 din yung level of significance nito. Yan, 0.05 yung alpha level of significance. Then we can say that yung ating mga treatments ay significantly, yan, treatment column, significantly different from each other. So, yan. So, sa LSD na result, sa least significant difference na result, then it shows that all the means ng mga treatments ay having different letters. So, that means that they are significantly different. And since that is 0.002 and 0.01 yung highly significant, then ang mga treatments natin ay highly significant also. So, kung mapapansin natin yung sa replication, this one, this one is 0.55 PR value yung sa replication. So, we can say that yung replication natin ay 0.5592. So, that is greater than 0.05. So, in this case, masasabi natin na yung replication natin ay similar to each other. So, our experiment was well replicated. Okay? So, that's it for the RCDD.